بسم الله والحمد لله وصلى الله على رسول الله This is Abu Afiq, Brother Ali, and Face to Floor wanted to put out a plug for a book, Alhamdulillah, that was recently published. It's called The Remedy, Islam, The Solution for Our Times. Inshallah, I'm going to include a link in the uh, video description. Inshallah, uh, it will be useful for people. It addresses a lot of the issues that we talk about here on the Face to Floor blog. And inshallah, what I'm going to do is read from the back cover of the book. Currently, it's just in the ebook form. Uh, you can just order it on Amazon. And inshallah, soon uh, we may have uh, physical copies depending on if there's a demand for it. But for the time being, it's in ebook form. So we're going to read from the back cover says the objective of the remedy is to address some of the fundamental challenges that people in modern society face. Our cultural malaise is essentially a spiritual one. And the answer is a spiritual one. Meaning you see the, the condition of the society and just where you, you find people having mental problems, drug problems, depression, all of these different things are is in essence caused by a spiritual problem. This is why we're saying that Islam is the remedy because it deals with not only the material needs of the human beings, but above all, and starting with the spiritual needs of the human beings. And then it goes on to say, the remedy starts by laying down the proper belief in the Creator. And this is the theme throughout the book, is talking about what is the proper belief in God, because this is the beginning of our spiritual journey. From there, the remedy addresses different ideologies and religions from a traditional Islamic perspective. There is so much, if you wish, noise and so much static out there in the public sphere that it was, it's very difficult for one to find the truth. I say for myself as a convert, Alhamdulillah, who started searching more than 30 years ago, praise be to Allah Ta'ala, and had to go through, and as the book addresses, the liberal ideology, uh, leftist ideology in particular, having to wade through, I went through a period of, of black nationalist ideology, new age-ism, and then even uh, among the people claiming to be Muslim, trying to find tradi traditional, genuine Islamic knowledge. And alhamdulillah, that, that knowledge is out there, it does exist, and for the one who strives and is sincere by the grace of Allah Ta'ala, they can find it. And the remedy itself is an introduction, inshallah, to save a, a person a lot of time searching and sifting to get to the core, which is having the proper understanding about who God is, and also about the proper belief in the prophets of God. It says, although the remedy is rooted in the Sunni Muslim tradition, it addresses contemporary issues and offers the ultimate solution. That is, we can only improve ourselves and our society by getting ourselves right with the Creator. It is through the obedience to Allah, Tabaraka wa Ta'ala. It is through self-rectification that we better ourselves and as we better ourselves, God willing, the society becomes better. So it's not, you know, the, the static of politics, the, the static of the general media. A lot of it talks about grants and money and, and, and government assistance and these things. We're not saying there aren't many, many people in need, but the beginning has to start with the person seeking to better themselves. This is the beginning. And the beginning of bettering oneself is to understand and to accept the proper belief in the Creator, that there's one perfect Creator who has no beginning, who has no needs, who has no similarities, that whatever you imagine in your mind, the Creator, Allah, is different from that. And also understanding that the Creator sent prophets, men who received divine revelation, and the last of the prophets is Prophet Muhammad, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, who came with the final law, the final sacred law for humanity to follow for their benefit in this life and in the hereafter. 
And that is the remedy, to know that and then to put it into practice. May Allah Ta'ala guide us and have mercy on us. And may Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala make the book, the remedy, Islam, the solution to our times. May Allah Ta'ala make it a widespread benefit. Walhamdulillah. Wa sallallahu ala rasulillah.